Now, we all know that solid bags can be a fantastically effective way of fishing, whether that's blasting them at showing fish or fishing three solid bags into an area over bait. It really can produce the goods on its day. Not long ago, we showed you the Gemini tidy stems, which are a really fast and efficient way of tying up a solid bag. However, there may be a number of occasions where you might find yourself having to use tubing, whether that's just for extra protection to the fish's flanks, or it might actually be a necessity due to the rules on the lake that you're fishing. Now, typically, fishing with tubing on a solid bag can be a real faff, because you've got your tubing fixed onto the line above your lead, and what that then means is if you miss a cast, everything's soaking wet, and it can be a real pain for then tying up new bags. Previously, there wasn't a very fast and efficient way of using a quick change setup with solid bags and tubing. However, Gemini have solved that problem with the Gemini Tidy Stem Tubing Kit, which is right here. So I'm gonna show you exactly how to use one of these to make your solid bag fishing much more simpler when you need to use tubing. So I'll start off with just opening up the packet so that you guys can see exactly what's inside. So you get a roll of tubing, it's nice, heavy tungsten tubing. You get a number of tidy stems, much like the normal tidy stems, but they've got a little extra length from the fluorocarbon inside. You also get some little sleeves, which kind of look a little bit like anti-tangle sleeves. And they're the key components for the tubing kit. Okay, so for starters, you want to take your tungsten tubing, unravel that, cut yourself your, your length that you want. I'm not going to go too long, just go about a foot or so. Cut that off at a nice little angle. Take your main line, cut that off at a nice angle too, and you want to start threading your tube in. Now obviously, you only need to do this once, so once you've got it through that first time, it shouldn't be too much faff. Getting it through is always the, uh, the hardest bit of all this. I find if you just hold it in your mouth, you can straighten out the tubing, it goes through that a little bit easier. So there you go, the tubing's on the main line. Next, you wanna take one of your tidy stems, and these are the five millimeter sizes, and there's two sizes, five and 5.75 millimeter, and that's to match different size leads. The cord lead that I've got here, which is four ounce square pair, that fits on the five millimeter size tidy stem. So you'll see there, just slips on nice and easily. Take a nice little short solid bag hook link. Pass the looping hook link through, and it's just a case of passing the rig itself back through the loop just to attach it via a loop to loop method. So now it's a case of just tying up your solid bag like you would with normal tidy stems. I'll grab myself a smallish sized solid bag. Get my rig neatly on my knee. Open up the bag just by giving it a quick little blow. I've got a nice mix here of small size pellets. First job is just laying the rig down in the bottom of the bag. Just trying to get the rig to lay flat. There you go. With the rig flat in the bottom, Start adding your pellets. And just pull the hook link back a little bit just to bring it away from the hook and hook bay itself. Place the lead in the middle of the bag. And fill it with pellets around the remaining solid bag itself. You want to give it a good tap. A bit of a tap on its side and that'll just move all those different sized pellets all around, just compacting them nicely just to make a nice, firm, solid bag. All right, so just give it another little top up there with the pellets now that I've compacted it all down. You can see my hook bait just in the corner. That's all compacted really nicely. And the great thing about these solid bag stems, the tidy stems, is because it's a nice, sort of firm bit of tubing on there, you can either tie it off with PVA or simply start twisting and just lick and stick the bag around the central stem and just make it a little bit more aerodynamic licking and sticking the corners round so there you go there's your nicely presented solid bag and you can actually make loads and loads of these up and that's the great thing about these 
tidy stem tubing kits. Take the little sleeve that looks a bit like an anti-tangle sleeve, thread that on, and then it's simply a case of just tying your, your solid bag on here. Like I say, you can make loads of these bags up in advance. And if you need a recast, your wet tubing's not actually gonna to touch it at all. I'm just using a Palomar knot there, so it's really simple. Just moisten the knot down, trim the knot, and you can then, you just need to feed the tubing just into the back of the little sleeve. Now again, you don't need to do this each time, you just do this on the first time of using it, and then that just stays on your line the whole time. Each time you need to change the bag, just take this one off, cut it off, tie a new bag on, just pull the tubing down, over the end and you've got your solid bag on a bit of tubing. So there you go, that's solid bag fishing with tubing made easy. For more information on these and any of the other great products from Gemini, check out the website www.geminicarptackle.com.